But I found me a new boo. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, thank you for stopping by. I'm Jaya, but you can call me Holly J. So I believe I've previously mentioned here on my channel, you know, some of my struggles and some of my insecurities when it comes to having a fuller figure breast and how I would refrain from wearing certain clothes or just couldn't buy them at all. From deep v-necks to strapless necklines due to just the weight of my natural breasts and the fact that they don't sit up right on my chest but since discovering boob tape and boob tape that actually works for me it's been my go-to solution and so now i will purchase that deep v bodysuit or that deep v dress or that strapless top because I have a solution for that extra support. But I found me a new boo who answers my one concern I've had thus far since discovering boob tape. And that is a natural flesh tone, brown girl friendly, undetectable wear boob tape. So yes guys, you can see that I received my new boo boob tape in the color chocolate for my 38D cup boobs. This is set to be waterproof, dance proof, last 12 hours or your money back for your ultimate lift and support. No, but on a serious note, I really wanted boob tape that was my skin tone color, and this bad boy is chef's kiss. Yes, y'all, my new boo delivers for all my big boob hacks and needs. So yes, y'all, today I wanted to put y'all on to this brown girl friendly product, but not only that, I wanted to also show you a variety of ways you can wear and tape your boobs for different clothing, just in case you're not aware of just how versatile boob tape can be. Okay, so now time for the hacks, okay? So first we're gonna start with this top. So this is just like a corset kind of top, cap sleeve top, you know, pleather look. And although it holds me in, cause you know it's like a corset and it has the little stuff going down to kind of pull you in. It's still, I'm still giving like, I can use like a little bit of a lift and like plumpness. So I'm going to use my tape to achieve that. So the way I would use my tape in this situation would be to place a piece here to lift and here to lift and then connect it and do a final lift over my elbow. Not my elbow, my shoulder. So again, I would take a small piece for a lift underneath and then a connecting piece over my shoulder and do the same on the other side and that would give me a nice little lift. So I'm gonna do that off camera and come back and see what we've got. Okay, so I wanted to give y'all a little bit of update on where I'm at with everything. So, like I said, I actually ended up putting two pieces here. You don't really need the bottom piece. I just put the bottom piece a little too low. So, right below your areola, hold your boob and put a nice, a nice size piece right over that. Hold and lift and put a nice one piece right below the areola. And then you can already see the lift. Oh wow, I don't even need, oh my gosh y'all. This is like live and direct right now. Like I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> wow, I don't even need the piece on my shoulder. And honestly that works out because I don't have to worry about it peeking through. Y'all, whoa, y'all are getting my direct review right now. Wow, 
Okay, so I'm just gonna do the same to the other side. So I figure I might be able to show y'all. So here's the breast that has not been done. So all I will do is lift it. Well, let's get your tape ready. So I got about this size piece. And less is more with this. I've learned that the hard way because the technology of boob tape is to stretch. So you can pull it, you know, you don't need a lot. You'll be overusing the product. Lift and place. So you're just gonna take it and stretch it. Stretch it over to your side and get it to stick. Bring that down and boom. We've got Supported tatas. Okay, with lift. Okay, so your infamous deep V neck tops and dresses. Okay, they're sexy. They make a statement, but are they for big boobs? Not necessarily. Not the ones I have. So, what are we gonna do? We're going to fix that with our boob tape. So, how I would utilize the boob tape in this situation would be definitely more straightforward over the nipple. Actually, lift the breast, so place under and up over the shoulder, for sure. The other top, you definitely just kind of mimic a strapless kind of style, but the only reason we didn't go straight across is because there was something showing in the middle. So if you had just a straight up strapless shirt, I would definitely recommend just putting the tape twice over your breast going this way. Before this top, we'll do the most original way of using boob tape, which is just lift the breast, push it under, place it under, and pull over your shoulder. So I'm gonna do one side off camera and then let's see if I can do this appropriately on camera okay so here's this side with the breast tape what i ended up doing was two original strips with lifting and putting over the shoulder and so i'll try to do the same on this side so i cut a decent amount because we're going from we're going from the bottom of the breast to the top of the shoulder you want to utilize a little bit more not too much more but a little bit um again less is more but be obviously like be be smart about it you know what i'm saying like from the underneath of your boob to your shoulder yeah you're gonna need a little bit more than just a strapless look but still you don't need to cut your whole arm's length it's a lift the breast underneath this time going right over the nipple shoulder okay so we're up to the shoulder we're under the boob, this is what you wanna have. And you'll do another, if you'd like. I ended up doing three pieces because I have pretty weighty boobs, so you can't really tell, but like there's a lot of spillage over here since we've moved and pressed the boob down, it spills over. You're never getting rid of your boobs, you know what I'm saying? Like you have to care for the spillage and that's why we're gonna do that curved support but that's why i did two going up and a curved support because like my breasts are not over here and we want to kind of 
support that as well because then that might look funny under some clothes with this set i probably could get away with not having to do that but in other clothes you'll definitely want to take care of that so i'm just going to go ahead and do that for the curve i went under the boob a little and pulled up 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 until it kind of met the top to kind of help with that spillage and boom boom a boom they're not going anywhere y'all they're not going anywhere so it would just be a matter of maybe some double-sided tape for a satin shirt like this so that it would stay in place so that you don't expose the tape but your boobs are good to go honey check out your check out your look check out your fit make sure it's doing what it's supposed to do you know cut any extra material get you some double-sided tapes so that your shirt stays in place but your boobs are good to go so that's all for today's video um i do want to leave you with a few little tips definitely invest in nipple covers for when you're using your boob tape just to keep your sensitive nipples protected and everything like that um, if you wear your boob tape for a long time it is made out of a sticky technology and it can be a little touchy on those nipples so definitely head over to Nubu and grab their nipple covers as well I'm loving this chocolate color boob tape it blends with my skin seamlessly it'll definitely look good under all of my clothing not just colors and dark colors i can now dibble and dabble in nudes and whites because of it so i'm super thankful for that thank you so much nubu for sponsoring this video and i hope to see you guys in my next one